Sunset vs. Windows Update by Unicop. Sunset Shimmer sat down at her desk, a warm cup of coffee in one hand and a list of notes she had jotted down for her assignment in the other. Normally, Sunset tried not to put off doing homework assignments till the very last minute. However, being she had been quite busy all week, what's with the friendship games, and then that whole mess with getting stuck in a bank elevator with Piggy, followed by finally being rescued in a state of undress, her assignment had taken a back seat for quite some time. Luckily for her, this was a simple essay assignment. Years of being Princess Celestia's student had taught her how to slap down a kick-ass essay in roughly 30 minutes tops. There was only one tiny problem in her way. Getting her computer to turn back on. Sunset pressed the power button and leaned back in her seat as her computer roared to life. After typing in her password, she glanced at her notes she had briefly taken when the essay had been assigned weeks earlier. Most of the information she needed was already there. Thank goodness she had tagged along with Human Twilight on that notes-taking seminar before the assignment, even though it was boring as hell. Turning back to her laptop, she noticed it had fully turned back on, and a pop-up had appeared bearing the message, This PC needs to restart for updates. Restart will commence at 9.45. Please save all work and close any open documents, followed by giving her the option to restart automatically. Sunsets were eternally as she glanced at the clock. It was currently 9.30. She had till 11 to get it done due to it being a late start day, but Windows updates were notorious for taking forever. She pressed the options for restart automatically, and leaned back in her chair, folding her arms, glaring at the screen as the infamous update began. Sunset thought back to the day she had first gone to the electronics store to choose her computer after winning a free laptop in a school raffle. At first, she had been hard set on getting a MacBook. Almost everyone at school used one. They supposedly were immune to computer viruses, and best of all, no annoying forced updates that prevented you from using your computer for an annoying long period of time. However, that one major drawback was their lack of ability to play computer games, which, thanks to Rainbow Dash, had been quite an addiction for Sunset. Glancing at her laptop, she noticed the update was at 12%, Turning to her watch showed her nearly 30 minutes had passed since the update started. Sunset swore eternally again as she began to wonder if she would ever get her assignment done in time. She briefly contemplated just writing the essay by hand, but then she remembered how illegible her handwriting was. Sure, she could read her own writing perfectly fine, but whenever someone else tried to read it, she usually ended up having to read it for them, thus causing her to become the butt of several jokes in class. Of course, this wasn't her fault. Years of being a pony, no less a unicorn at that, had taught her to write using her mouth or magic, so trying to write with her hands for sunset was akin to writing with your feet for everyone else. The update was now at 50%, and she now had less than an hour to complete her assignment. She debated feign illness to give her more time, only she knew her legal guardians would never fall for it. Especially after doing the cha-cha heading downstairs for breakfast after getting a message from Pinkie Pie agreeing to go on an actual date this weekend. Her new girlfriend's tendencies were starting to rub off on her. 60% updated and only half an hour left till she had to leave. Sunset started pulling her hair out of her head in frustration. There was no way in Tartarus she was going to finish it in time. 70% updated and 20 minutes left. Sunset's coffee was stone cold, but her temper had reached an all-time high. She debated chucking her laptop out the window, but she opted not to for fear of hurting a neighbor. Not to mention the fact she wouldn't be able to afford another one. 
80% updated in 10 minutes left. She heard her godmother shout goodbye from below and reminding her to leave for school on time. Sunset shouted goodbye back, her eyes not once leaving the screen. 90% complete and 5 minutes left on the clock. Maybe she could copy and paste Twilight's essay. She had emailed her the previous day for a revision. Twilight was going to be absent from school all week for some academic triathlon anyway. And Sunset could just explain to Twilight her dilemma and offer to help her write a new essay when she got back. At last, the update reached 100%. Sunset leaped out of her chair, punching the air in triumph. However, her celebration was short-lived as a new pop-up appeared bearing the words, We apologize, but some of the updates failed to install correctly. Please restart your PC to finish installing these updates. This may take a while. We apologize for the inconvenience. Sunset just stared at the message in utter disbelief. Her time was up, and she was going to have to show up for class empty-handed. Sunset's hands clenched into fists as she slammed her laptop shot and prepared to leave for school asking herself what else could possibly go wrong that day. Her answer came in the form of a text message from Rainbow Dash showing a screenshot of an article about her and Pinky being found naked in a bank elevator which had apparently had gone viral all over the internet that morning. Sunset swore out loud this time and made a mental note to kill Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie after school. It was obviously going to be one of those days.